All right, guys, welcome back to Cracked Housing Fab. We're gonna continue working on the cross cover. All right, guys, so yeah, we're gonna be putting a little bit more of the frame together. We're excited to get to this point because it's gonna kind of start to take some shape. So that's gonna be pretty cool. So Kurt's kind of figuring out what we want to do here, getting some measurements. This is exciting. Yeah, this is gonna finally take some shape. Cause it's kind of like, it looks cool now, but it's gonna look even better with the kind of more of the frame put in there. All right, so Kurt's working on getting this set up in the bender. So what we're going to do is these pieces that come across here, we're gonna copy those and make two more and then set them up at a little higher angle up above here. That way we kind of have something to hold us in, not hold us in, but on your sides while you're driving. But yeah, so we're gonna get this guy bent up. So we got some of the frame rails in. They're just kind of mocked up right now. So this is just kind of what we're thinking for the design. I love it. We'll add some other braces in later, but this is just kind of our theme. I think it looks pretty good. Yeah. And remember, we're gonna have a floor in here about this height and it feels good when you're sitting in there. The height wise, I like it. Yeah, it turns out really good. And once we get some more bracing in there, get the floor in there, it'll really start making sense. And then once we get the pieces coming up over the top too, that'll look pretty cool. All right, guys, we got the other side bent up. So we got both of them in place. It's starting to look really cool. Really excited to kind of see it come together. This side here, we did a little different back here by our chain. We couldn't cut in so close, but I think this looks better the way we came around. Yeah, we had that to kind of cool. account for the chain drive being in the way. We had to come around it. But it kind of makes all this not look like it sticks out so far. Yeah, we look at it from the back. I think that looks good. Like it looks part of it. Before it looked like it was just sticking out in, in midair, but now it looks better. And it's protected. Yeah. It's not out there where branches are gonna get stuck in the chain and you know we can even come off of here with a nice little shield at some point. Yep. Kind of cover that, but now we just have to tack it, weld it in. I like it. Just sitting there. It looks good. I mean, in, like looking from here. It we does it as uh, narrow as possible. Yeah, and you want a little bit of breathing room in there. You don't want to be crunched in there like uncomfortable. Because we'll probably have maybe a, a break e-brake maybe but we're gonna have the shifter yeah so you gotta have a little bit of room yep but i like it We have the the top rails all welded in now gets to be the fun part building the roll cage and uh the top part and we want to get this just right because this is going to determine the look of our whole cross cart so he's kind of notched this already so somewhere in here yeah I'll stand back that way. Piece. so kind of taking that angle looks nice we determined that's a 41 degree angle <laughs> but that's what it came out to we're going to go straight bend this and then back here, kick the last little bit down. So we'll straight, kick down. It should give it a nice look. So this is kind of what we came up with. Uh, we started out, we we're gonna go flat at the top, but then we kind of started looking at it and then, and then we're using the Harbor Freight Bender, which isn't the best for bending pipe. It, it can kink <laughs> it if you try to do it too far. Um, unfortunately, that's what we have to work with right now. We can't, uh, we don't have a real pipe bender. But anyways, 
This kind of I think it looks pretty cool. What do you think? I like it. Yeah. Once we get the other one done and we get the loop for around the seat for the roll bar put in. Yeah, we're gonna have a piece come up here and kind of tie all this together right over our heads to be good and safe in case we roll it over. <laughs> but I, I think it's it's kind of a cool look. I like it. Yeah. I just got a copy and paste. two top roll bars put in place. I think they turned out really sweet. What do you think, Sean? I think it's awesome. They're just sitting in there right now. We still have to tack all them in, but I don't know. I think it's uh, kind of stand back, get a good profile view here. Yeah, and for height wise, let me sit in here. So you gotta imagine they're gonna be sitting here. You're gonna have a steering wheel. So that's gonna be there. And then we're gonna have a helmet on. Yep. Most likely. So you know, you don't want to bounce your head off. So we got nice space up here. We can have our pedals, shifter. Heck yeah. I like it. This thing's turning out so cool. We still have obviously other braces and whatnot to add in, but. Yeah, we got a roll bar to add behind the seat here coming down. Yep. So we don't smash our arms if we flip, but this is looking <laughs> cool. This is a lot of work to make these, but um, the hard work paid off, I think. All right, guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and get these uprights welded in. Uh, but cool thing is, is uh, make sure and subscribe to our channel. So we noticed a lot of you guys are watching and we have like a ton of freaking views over the last two or three weeks and uh, we really appreciate it, it's so awesome. But uh, yeah, subscribe, it helps us out big time. We really wanna get to that 10,000 subscriber mark. It's gonna be a huge milestone for us. We're freaking pumped that we're getting this far as we are right now, but yeah, do the right thing, subscribe for us, we really appreciate it. All right, guys, we just finished up the roll cage on our cross cart. We added in these cool supports. It really tied it together, put some braces in. I think it has really nice lines. Super happy with how it turned out. We have some other little things to trim up, some other braces, but the whole thing is coming together. The whole shape, very exciting. Heck yeah, dude, I'm so stoked. This thing is turning out awesome, even better than I envisioned. But anyways, guys, we're gonna wrap this one up here. Uh, leave us a comment. Like this video, share this with some of your friends, man. We really appreciate it. We want to hit that 10,000 subscriber mark. But uh, yeah, thanks a lot and thanks for watching Crack Housing Fab.